Hello? What's happening? <laughs> right, yeah, I don't know. I guess OBS is just having a having a fit and I like, get maybe his twitches as well. Um Jesus Christ. Uh, I was gonna say we would uh, call it there, but uh we'll uh we'll keep on going. We'll keep on going. What can we do, eh? Alright, well, here's your payment. Oh, forgive me, Mrs. Claypole. What you find? Well, she had a brooch here. It looks like diamonds. Well, this will do. Now get out of here before someone sees you. I can't believe it's come to this. All right, well, uh, I'm out of here. That you should maybe cover, cover the grave, though. <laughs> no? Can I, there's an X here. Can I, like, loot? Oh, God. Eh, uh, what the... Fuck is that? Comes to life. No. Okay. Where to? Where did Lee to? Stranger there. Let us go. Investigate. What happened here? Oh, Lord. I don't know what happened there, good sir. But yeah, I'd say if it happens, like if it does that reconnect thing one more time, then yeah. I mean, that, Jesus, how many different like problems are we going to have? The first stream started and... It was just awful. What is that? Is that a dog? Is it pooing? Oh, I'm sorry. I, I, I won't look. Um, So I had the stream at the beginning just absolute disintegrate and not work. And then we just had it slowly drop frames. And then it's somehow like disconnected. Weirdly. You okay there, mister? You need me to move. Move? I am. I'm sitting in the wrong place. Excuse me? No, I didn't mean any offense, sir. Please. I don't get your meaning. I'm very sorry, sir. You have yourself a fine day, and I apologize for any offense I may have inadvertently caused. What are you drinking, mister? Nothing, sir. Nothing at all. Why are you acting so strange? I don't mean to. I'm sorry for any offense. How could you have offended me? I have no idea. But I had no idea how I offended the last fellas. And they stole my wagon on account of my impudence. Stole your wagon for back check? Mm, they didn't like my medical practice, I suppose. I was helping folk. And that wasn't popular? I was undercutting the competition. Or I was too colored. Or I was irritating in nature. Or I was... Some know-it-all, big city slicker here to demean some good old boys of my fine words. The exact variety of my sins was the source of some conjecture, so they undercut me. That ain't very nice. That was my impression. Still, compared to the gutting, castration, defenestration, and crucifixion they offered me, I felt I got off lightly. Imaginative bunch. <laughs> yes, but no great love of my medical practice. Too free with my wisdom and services. Which way they go? Down the road, that away. Stay here. I'm sort of forced to. Please don't go to any trouble on my account. Mm -hmm. What's that dog ruling any shit? Oh, please. Were you looking for that fella's wagon? I heard him say they was taking it to Macomb's Inn. Okay, thanks. Thank you, sir. 
Okay, come on, I'll let it fall. Do you think Twitch might be having an issue? Either Twitch or OBS. Or both. I wouldn't be surprised. Because, yeah, I mean, this has never happened before this often. Um. So, yeah, I don't know. Not downloading anything, nobody in the house is, so... Just has to be, doesn't it? Bears on both, yeah. Okay, so we'll get this uh, this guy's wagon back. Oh, is it back in the swamp? Oh, great. Oh god. Yeah. yeah. Where am I going? Far away. Oh, I guess I can't cut it anywhere. This is the only way to it. Yeah, when I think of like bayous now, I immediately think of the one in um, AC3 Liberation and um, Mafia 3. Nothing on Twitch support Twitter. Yeah, I don't know. Again, it could just be like a select few people. Um, not sure. I guess it's, yeah, it's pretty annoying. Okay, this is where the moonshine stuff was. Now what do we have? Bolt action rifle. That'll do. Sorry, I mean, he, listen, he did it. Oh, this is a nice one shot. Oh, no, shot. He's still alive. Oh, don't dodge me now. Thank you for the lurk, Max. Do some looting, the houses and everything. Since I believe us to be the only people here now. Old plate buckle. What we got? Nothing. Crash. Oh. Okay. Get on the wagon. Do some looting first. Give me a sec. We're in the mud. Oh, that's so steep. God. Oh, that's beautiful.
Miracle tonic. Right. Yeah, this mud is. Jesus, look at that. Okay, come on. Doctor Renaud. Got a little, uh, what was that, pestle and mortar on top? Yeah, it's pretty cool. Oh shit. I want his hat off, I want him off. Oh, wrong way. This thing is very tall and thin. It'll tip over any second. Oh god. Yeah, you go good, sir. Got your medicine wagon uh, back. Oh, look who it is! I did not count on seeing that wagon again. Nor you, for that matter. Only people you won't be seeing are the folks who took it. Uh, I take it they aren't the only ignorant bullying clodhoppers in these parts. But I can live in glorious hope. Yeah. It wasn't a trouble now, was it? No, it was a pleasure. Well, let me give you something for your pleasure. Ah, what we got here. Ah, how about this? Provide a man a tincture, he'll be well for a day. Teach him to make one, he might be well a while longer. I'll make sure to try and make this. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. It won't work for anything chronic, but you may not need it to. Well, you see me on my travels and you're in need of something? Make sure you come and say hello. Travel safe now. Well, he was nice. Okay. We'll go. Yeah, now we've got this whole uh, graze thing still to do. I don't know what these little white areas are. Are they like city boundaries or something? Town boundaries? I mean, that's got one around it, but it's not in white. Um, tomorrow's Friday. You survived another week. Yeah. Excited for the weekend. Um, Bill Williamson? Uh, Sodom, back to Gomorrah. Bomor Alright, I think we'll jump into uh, into this. I think this is the main mission of the of chapter three. Don't let us get on the horsey.
Okay. Let's go. Has anyone seen an Englishman called Gavin? Gavin? Or Gavin? Hello, mister. Listen, have you seen... I'm looking for my friend, Gavin. Gavin. I don't know any Gavins, I'm afraid. Englishman. Lovely fella. He went missing and uh, now I'm all alone. Good luck. Gavin's that's, friend. Uh, that's too bad. Gavin! <laughs> Gavin! Every time I hear Gavin now, though, I immediately just think to the Gavin from like Achievement Hunter or Slow Mo Guys. Alright, well, I guess we might find Gavin in our travels somewhere. Getting in front of the bullets for this guy. I wouldn't hang out by me if Grays are on the hunt. And he's just running. Oh, well, sweet Gavin. Wonder if they ever revealed what happened to Gavin. Run into that poor sod in several locations. No. Oh, this is the big graze area. God. Am I allowed through here? What happened? What was that? Who the hell are you, boy? Jesus, you're an angry fella. God. Still out. Okay, I think somebody needs to be killed. My first, uh... My first thing there. Let's just run through these tobacco fields. Hopefully there's nobody watching. People in the fields, but there's no guards. I can see there's a guy on a horse there. Guards there. Leave it there. See what we can do. Is this enemy area and stuff? People with guns. A bit scared. Hello, kind sir. Hey, uh, I was hoping you'd talk a moment. I'm a student of the history of the region and. Uh... I ain't the one to speak to. Try Master Bo. Think he's down there by the wood store. Boy's got all the time in the world. A bull. Okay. From some cookies? No problem. I'll see you at the sheriff's office. Excuse me, friend. We friends? Not yet, but he is hoping. I what guess. is Arthur doing? We don't get a lot of traveling men here, and suddenly there's a whole phalanx of mysterious but strangely helpful Yankees about the place. Is there? What are you doing here? I'm just looking for work. Well, looking for something. Don't worry, your secret's safe with me. What secret? I got a secret of my own. Are you secretly normal? Excuse me? Never mind. The thing is, I don't care if you kill the whole lot of us and the Braithwaite's. I don't want to kill anyone. I love her, you know. Love who? Penelope. But it's impossible. Well, love tends to be complicated. She's a Braithwaite. I'm Bo Gray, son of Tavish Gray, nephew of Lee Gray, the sheriff, grandson of old Murdo Gray. 
We Greys have been loyal to the state and murderers to the Braithwaites for so long now, no one can even quite explain why. Beyond blind loyalty and stupidity, I'm supposed to be loyal to some nonsense while she... She's amazing. She's like a woman from the future. She's like tomorrow, if tomorrow turns out fine. Well, I'm sorry for your predicament. Would you help? I don't want to get involved in <laughs> gang feuds. It seems unseemly. I'll pay. I've got money. We grays, we've always got money. No brains, mine, but money. Well, in that case... I know she loves to sit out in the gazebo on the edge of the Braithwaite property. Take her this letter and this bracelet, please. Oh, look out for their guards. They're worse with strangers than ours are. Oh god, okay. Nom nom. So long, and good luck. Alright, come here, horsey. Oh, he just went through those hedges. And this game is so freaking beautiful. It certainly is. Does the game need to be louder, do you think? I'm trying to look at it now. And now it's not at 100%. Would the game do with uh, an increase? Do you think? There's guards there, so I kind of want to get out. Yeah, as quick as possible. Could I guess just go the way we came, but do that. I don't think this is an enemy area, but that guy seemed really angry. When we, uh, like, greeted him and stuff. Don't worry, I'm not trampling your crops. There you go. music. Right, where do I need to go? Okay, so the, yeah, they're not that far away. Yeah, this guy in one family is, uh, Going out with somebody from the, uh, the the rival rival family. Looks very really good. Alright, that guy said something about them not being friendly. Don't let us. Please, please, oh, I don't God. have any time for any gossip now. Eh? Yeah. Huh? Yes. Look at you. Oh, that scared us. Jesus. Hey, uh, Master Work Noob. How are you doing? Welcome. I hope, uh, hope you're doing okay. You're more likely to be spotted on horseback. Dismount and move quietly to avoid attention. Uh, you're pretty good. How are you? I'm doing well. The stream has been, uh, been pretty bitty today. I think I've had to restart about four times. Um, but yeah. Not a good part, but we're, we're back. Trying to, uh... To get some progress in these missions, yeah. On chapter three at the moment. Don't know where these guards are.
be one over there. Be one there. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I don't have all the emotes. I've, uh, I've selected a few though from uh, BTTV that uh, that I like. So have uh, we'll have a few. So do you play Red Dead then? What uh, what types of games do you play? Anything with a good story, indeed. Yeah, we're uh, I mostly play single player games here. Um, I've replaced this as my main game. I normally play Assassin's Creed. Um, we did uh, not that long ago just finish uh, a Valhalla playthrough. It took around 140 hours for a 100% playthrough. So uh, that was a lot of fun. But uh, yeah, so so mostly it would be Assassin's Creed, but uh, been branching out into other a series like uh, Red Dead and stuff. And we did Mafia Three as well. That was a fun one. Lego Hobbit best story. Yeah, we also play some Lego games as well, just to uh, mix up games a bit. Hey there, miss. Are you Penelope Braithwaite? Well, yes, I am. I've got a letter for you. Oh. And a gift. <laughs> a letter and a gift. Well, we don't even know each other. <laughs> well, it's not from me. It's from... Uh... From Bo. <gasps> oh... He is so... Strange? Well, yes, he's a little strange, but also so human. The rest of our families are stuck in the Dark Ages, or... Well, I don't know, cave people, perhaps. Bo's different, but if they find out, they'll kill him and send me to live someplace awful, like Ohio. Have you ever been to Ohio, sir? No. Well... Neither have I, but my uncle has a factory there. He was sort of the black sheep on account of having left. But now they tolerate him because he's a vicious snob. Families are... are there's something else. <laughs> you got a family, sir? No, not really. Well, they tolerate him because of the money. But me, with my ideas above my station, they can't stand. That sounds pretty complicated. I, I don't know quite what to say. Well, nothing to say, except I hope they all rot. I don't. Uh, well, maybe a bit. But here, if you see Bo again, will you give this to him? Sure. Can she escort us out of here so we don't have to, you know, crouch the whole way? Is there a boat that we can get on? I'd steal that horse, couldn't I? Huh. Uh, you do play a lot of uh, League of Legends, but you love games that have story. You played uh, GTA, uh, League of Legends, Battlefield 1, Overwatch, Rust, uh, RSS. I'm trying to think what that is. Mountain Blade 2, Bannerlord, Warband, sometimes uh, Steep. Did play uh, AC Black Flag. Yeah, AC Black Flag is probably one of my favourites for story. Um, yeah, it's really good. Rainbow Six Siege, that's it, okay. Alright, no uh, no problem, Mona. Thank you very much for uh, for stopping by today. I really appreciate it. Um, 
nice seeing you. I hope uh, everything uh, everything goes well. And uh, yeah, definitely see you uh, very soon. Thank you so much. Oh wait. That guy's not there anymore. Okay, let's get on this boat then. Can I use this? Hell yeah. Looks pretty scary. Uh, you didn't complete it. It was just too hard a mission. You couldn't pass literally no way in the world you would have completed it. Is that by chance a naval mission with a boat? Um, because yeah, those naval missions are, uh, are a piece of work. I think for some of them you have to have like a certain amount of upgrades to even ha like have a chance of, of beating them. Uh, otherwise it's literally not possible. You'll just get like one hit by anything. Uh, oh, it wasn't land. Oh, okay. I'm not too sure about uh, which one that is then. Yeah, I didn't do like 100%, but um, yeah, it was my first time playing it uh, last year. Because I, uh, I did just give up on it. Because it was, the naval combat got too annoying for us. But uh, now that I've played it, definitely want to get back to it at some point. If anything, just for the story alone. Yeah, I have, uh, uh, what's it called, um, Mountain Blade have been on my list for quite a while of, of games that I want to try. Um, it seems like something I would be interested in. I play, uh, like, what, Total War and, uh, Civilization and stuff like that. I feel like it's kind of, like, a mix of both, maybe. Um, so yeah, I do know Battlelord came out not that long ago. That one's pretty new. It was pretty early. Uh, it was around some big fields with green and there were some uh, big, big wells in the city. And always you would get yourself lost. Killed by gods, you just couldn't. Oh, is it like a mission where you had to do it like stealthily or something, like you couldn't be seen? Yeah, those ones can uh, be pretty uh, tricky, definitely. Oh shit, we're tired. Um, energy, please. Do we not have anything that just gives energy? Hey, okay, baked beans it is. A little bit. Um, it came uh, like in May or something. Bought it instantly. Yeah, I mean, I saw tons of like uh, trailers for it and stuff, but... I was going to get um, Warband before I, I bought the new one, but I, again, haven't gotten around to it yet. There's tons of games that I've, that I've got that I still need to play, so yeah, it just, uh, it just goes on my list. Lock it up properly. I've just ride it up onto the... Uh, the little beach. Hey, bro bought it uh, for 40 euros because he had uh, Warband too. Yeah, I've seen a lot of people play Warband, so that's what is like getting us interested in that. Um, yeah, actually, I mean, I haven't played Total War in ages. But that's one of my favourite like franchises to play. And Civ. The camp has lots of fun still. Our horse needs brushing, but the horse is all the way over there. I think we can call him back. Give that a go. Don't you have any warmer clothes? You're gonna catch a chill. 
tells me to put warmer clothes on. Arthur! Stay away from me. Oh. But I got a chance. That's exactly what I'm afraid of. Oh, it's a goodie. I'm yes, Sadie. It always is with you. Then we end up hidden in a burning oh. barn getting shot at. You're a sad man, Arthur Morgan. Sad man indeed. How are you doing, CD? Next time we run an errand together, remind me to pack more bullets. Come on, Arthur. Don't pretend that wasn't kind of fun. <laughs> I finish in school, uh, I'm yeah. ready to ship out to see myself. It's okay. Everything ends. Right, can we call the horse back from this? Because we did upgrade it. Like, we'll get a discount based on how many uh, Mountain Blade games you have. Uh, would have a price of 25 euro or so. Oh, that's pretty good. Retrieve Alter 4. There you are. Give her a good brush. Let's get you cleaned up. Alter 4 Monger W. Yeah, that's what we called him. Okay, and we don't have any. Oh no, we do have a mission. It was Bill, wasn't it? I need a word with you, Morgan. Who's Bob? That's the name of a horse. Oh, Bob. What is it? We got something cooking you might be interested in. Am I gonna like the sound of this? Been cooking since Horseshoe, but you went and kicked up all that commotion in Valentine. Now, we was preparing to rob the bank there until you got involved in all that nonsense, and I don't know, I just feel like it's unfinished business. That wasn't my fault. It was just one of them things. Now, how come every time I get in trouble, I'm called a fool and an idiot? But when you get in trouble, oh, it's just one of them things. <laughs> it's a good point, Arthur. A very good point. All right, well, what do y'all want me to do? Hit the goddamn bank with us. <laughs> you really think it's worth going back there? Four of us can hit the bank easy, but I ain't gonna lie to you. There will be law if we linger. And if you're serious? No, just local boys being rounded up and pressed into action. Meaning? If we go in quick and quiet, we can hit it just fine. If there's four of us, I mean. Y'all think it's worth the risk? It's a bank, Arthur. So? Is the take good? According to the fella I met, yes. It's the end of the stock sales. Plenty of money and plenty of people milling about. <sighs> All right. I suppose it's worth taking a look at least. We should wait until the morning. In any case, I need to change out of these rags if I'm going to be performing. Okay. So, Bill... This better be worth it. Oh, it is. We put a lot of research into this one. I hope so. Oh god, the mercenaries. Alright. Let's go. They're after us. Mr. Morgan. Bank robbery pog you? Mr. Indeed it is. That is a big pog you. Thomas Downs? Apparently he's dead. Dead? Oh no. Oh no, he didn't seem very well. His wife. I believe he has a wife and child. She will assume the debt, of course. Of course. Then you can head up there and collect. He lent them a lot of money. Okay. Gentlemen, let's go rob ourselves a bank. What's the plan then? Oh, we're gonna send Karen on in ahead as a uh, distraction. Then we're just gonna rush on in afterwards. Just a small bank in a little town. Nothing that big in way of security. We just need to bring you along as a uh, insurance policy. Yeah, that sounds about right. How are you doing, Blood right. Moon? Follow me. Good to see you. I hope you're well. The fuck was that? That house get the share of you. That is the uh, Galahorn. That is the um, alert sound from the mercenaries slash zealots in uh, Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Um, so when one of them is close to you, that horn sounds to tell you that they're next to you. And you know, either you can run away or you can try and kill them. Um, but yeah. I imagine being demise, uh, this one has haunted him since AC Valhalla. As indeed. <laughs> the horn still works. It does. 
traumatized. They won't recognize her. I'll show you boys how it's done. What are you thinking this time? I don't know. Fellers always liked a lost little girl, but nobody plays a drunken harlot boy like me. Either should work. Once she's got them distracted, we'll move in. Your dream tonight uh, won't day, really go your way. Only a couple of guards. Yeah. We deal with them and any customers who are feeling brave. And you always fancy yourself as the vault man, right, Arthur? Now I see why you brought If I uh, if I watch other people play Valhalla and I hear that sound, I just I immediately I start looking for like who redeemed the sound bit or you know stuff like that. <laughs> it freaks us out. So yeah. I'm doing, I don't know. No, I do know. I'm pretty shit, actually. Oh no! Why does that blood move? So, how are you feeling about this, Lenny? Well, at first I thought it was a bad idea, but then I figured they all are if you think about them long enough. Certainly have been recently. I mean, why the hell not? Roll with it. I just told him we needed you along. Uh, I appreciate the confidence, kid. And if we didn't rob this bank, we really would be slipping. Thoughts like that? And you're one of us, no doubt. Sure hope so. All right. Need to feed the horse before we go. Yes, we're doing this then. Robbing a bank. All the way back in Valentine. That's a decent trek, isn't it? My god, that's miles away. Wait, where's our camp? There? It is there. Uh, your job is busy uh, in an unfulfilling way today. Or less fulfilling. I'm sorry to hear that. Um, yeah, I hope, uh, yeah, thanks. <laughs> uh, Friday tomorrow, moved on from there now, and, uh, so the weekend, we so. We must have sent enough of a message. I reckon so. <laughs> I ain't lose much sleep over them fellas. Me neither. They'd have loved nothing more than a uh, strangling. the pebs keep calling. That weren't gonna happen. <laughs> not through lack of trying. Nah, not to you. You'll outlive a lot of us. Good haul, too. That dynamite should come in real useful today. Yeah, if we can even get near them. And you have to answer their tech support questions, but it's like talking to a drunk. Yeah. Just keep your eyes open. Granted, I speak drunk pretty fluently. Do you know about fastest horse in the game? Um, I mean, this one I got for free. And it has, like really good stats so you know i don't have that much money to spend on a horse so getting this one for free was uh was just perfect so Hell yeah. We wait till after the bank, all right? oh, but this is a whole new level today. I don't even know how you're asking because you're uh, using so many terms and so many wrong names, so many wrong ways. Probably only have uh, another hour left, maybe two. Depends uh, how much you want to work tomorrow. Reckon we'll skip the saloon this time, kid. <laughs> no doubt. Not to forget. Yeah, next time I know what you mean by a couple of drinks. <laughs> whiskey's got me in more trouble than a pistol ever has. What's that about whiskey? Uh, <laughs> keep going, Miss Jones. Keep it down now. We're here. 
Wait, is this Valentine or is this the Emerald Ranch? What's this Valentine? Okay. Morning. Morning. Hey, Mister. Dog barking at okay. silly boy. Let's leave the horses here off the main drag. All right, gentlemen, here we are. Okay, get ready. All right, back to work and avoiding uh, angrily glaring at the phone okay. for you. The stream is helping though, so thanks for that. Of course. I appreciate it, Blood Moon. Um, yeah, indeed. I hope the the rest of the All like right. the hour or Keep two hours can go uh, me, pretty smoothly for you. And uh, yeah. Ready tomorrow. Uh, fill out a little bit. Uh, thank you for uh, for stopping by. We never decided. Is it lost little girl you want or the drunken harlot? Um. Eh. So which one? Harlot. Uh, of course, you know I like the harlot. You're the only one. You're a bunch of filthy sinners and the heartbreakers, Zolania. <laughs> now where is he? If you're ready, get going. Good luck, gentlemen. We got this. Well, they just give us a new rifle. Oh no. Get the fuck down. Can I hog tie them? Okay, the door's unlocked. Oh, one's a little pink box there. I want it. Open it. Shut up, bitch. Hurry up. Come on. Okay. Not going any faster. Taking his time, is he? There we go. I'm in. Someone come make sure the suit behaves himself in here. Come here. <laughs> Open the lock boxes now. I, the, 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 the manager does that. I, God damn it. Now what? Guess I'll crack them or blow them up. Keep an eye out. Blow them up? Quick as I can. Oh shit. Yeah, I Maybe we can try and crack them. I, I don't know how this works. Quit. Crack you open the safes. The Move it slowly. Down the closer you crack the safe and Oh, it zooms in, okay. How much 
fuck? There we go. I don't know how much time we'll have. Oh my god, look at all that. Three grand! Oh my god. Oh fuck. It's around zero. There we go. How much is in there? Oh. That'll be a decent bit. Four grand. Greed is good. That was on 10. Oh, I think that's another four grand. What's what, what we got for time? Oh, no, that's not four grand. That was like 2.7. Do we go now or do we get the last one? I don't know how this shit works. Alright, well that was five grand from that. Fuck. No. Move faster. Now we go, come on. Go. Oh, I can't run. I think. Uh, I think we're fine. Come on, I'll lead the way. Let's go. Buddy, stay calm. Keep your mouth shut. You understand me? We have our mask. Oh, it's already on. You don't know how to pronounce that uh the name, you just say the moon. I think it's like L Lemoyne. Lemoyne, maybe. Why are we why are we going slow? Oh shit. Run away. All right. yeah, yeah. Now let's get the hell out of this goddamn. Oh, you're right, that's how you see it. Please do a stun so you can feel not as drained from the last couple of uh, pleb calls. Right, we'll try and uh, maybe it's after we get out of this big, you know, chase. We'll try and find a nice uh, jumping spot. We'll, uh, we'll definitely do something. Alright, what weapons do I have? Let's get out a shotgun. Uh, pump action. And... Double barrel. Six, nice. Oh shit. I've gone the wrong way of me friends. Oh fuck. Was I supposed to do that? Oh fuck me. I wasn't paying attention. Okay. Quick point time. Uh, it doesn't have to be while you're uh, wanted. Uh, thanks either way. <laughs> yeah we'll figure it out. We'll, uh, we'll do a we'll do a stunt. Now let's get the hell out of this goddamn town. 
can give you a tip with that. Uh, did I? Yeah, sure. Is, is there a way to to hold it to use on multiple people? Or is that just with specific uh, weapons? Because I was able to do that, but I don't know if it's, you know, a pistol or like that. targets with Q. You can mark as many people as how many bullets. Ah, okay, that's how you do it, yeah. I just thought you, it was, uh, you just uh, pressed the button to shoot while you were in Dead Eye. I was wondering why I was only able to do one at a time. Thank you for that. I feel like it's always easier to hit the horses, maybe. And I uh, go on straight for the people. They're still coming. He only offered us 360 spins and shoots the targets without looking or having his weapon aimed at him. Yeah, I've seen that happen a couple times. I'm like, I'm not aiming at the person at all. Um, but yeah, we end up hitting them somehow. some other business to attend to. Don't head directly back to camp and make sure you ain't followed. <sighs> okay. Uh, Welcome back, Swinzy. Okay, how much money do we get from that then? Not gonna tell us? We easily should get like, what? Two and a bit grand, three grand from that? The, if the pay works how it does? Yeah. take from this you have to complete it okay right yeah because i mean what we've got like two five grands multiple like 2.7 grands and like a couple three grands or something there's our old camp up there as well rest in peace right where are we going uh okay. like 16 to 20k yeah i know it was a big heap um, thanking you, he ate my McCoys, and uh, dude, they have, had so much flavour, he took your time. Yeah, those McCoys, like the, like the ridge cut ones, my god, so much flavour. Actually insane. Uh, McCoys, it's like a... Are you, are you from the UK? Are you from US? Whereabouts are you from somewhere else in uh, in Europe? You did say uh, Euros before, I think. Yeah, McCoys are a, are a crisp. Type of crisp. Uh, are you Romanian? Okay, very cool. You pronounce that? It's literally uh, saying my balls. <laughs> my balls are crisp. Yeah, McCoy's is a is a is a brand of. Uh, is it Walker's crisp? I don't know. I think we're the only people that call them Walkers. I think everybody else calls them Lays. My husband. 
husband's not cold in the ground and you come back here. Archie, I nearly paid off what was owed. Your husband knew the rules when he took that money. Now, I'm real sorry about the way things turned out, but he had a choice. Ain't my fault about the way the world is. He didn't have a choice. He was good and he did good. There wasn't no choice in that. And you've as good as killed him yourself. And don't kid yourself. You had a choice. You speak as if killing was something I cared about. You ever wonder about eternity? You should. I hope it's hot and terrible, Mrs. Downs. Otherwise, I'll feel I've been sold a false bill of goods. Now, please, give me that money. <sighs> Either you got a lazy eye or lack of respect. Which is it, boy? I ain't got no lazy eye. No respect for the lacks of you. Well, maybe when your mother's finished mourning your father, I'll keep her in black on your behalf. You think on that, boy? Well, maybe you shall, sir. And maybe other events will transpire. You best stick to them books, because mark my words on this. Vengeance is an idiot's game. Ah, Mrs. Downs, thank you for your punctuality. It's next to godliness, isn't it? That's cleanliness. I'll have to take your word on that. Good day. Good day. Imagine your shock hearing someone is eating McCoy's. <laughs> yeah. Can't believe you just talked to Corby and it turns out we were part of the same theatre group in Munich. We have a lot of friends in common and we only missed each other by one year. Because you left and she joined a few months after. Damn. We are champs stealing from the poor. <laughs> Buy them a house. Or just become Mr. Beast. You get a house. You get a horse. Gang share 10 grand. Oh, that's a decent chunk. I'll take that. I won't complain. But uh, two and three quarters thousand. Decent chunk. So wait, does that mean the gang now has like a 10 grand uh, like stock or something? Oh, it's that hand game again. Um, okay, where is the... Is it over here? I think it's, yeah, it's behind Dutch's stuff. The ledger. Yeah, it's back here. Evening, Uncle Arthur. I just want to say thank you to Miss Karen, Bill, Lenny, Arthur. They're doing their jobs. The rest of us, uh, we should hang our heads in shame. They remembered to rob the goddamn bank in Valentine. <laughs> Rest of us, rest of us are slipping. Pride. Never forget the pride in our work. You four, I salute you. Basically, Tank here just one of the NPCs who don't do nothing with it. Yeah, that's, uh, you know, something, I guess. Now we've got over three grand. Give all debts. Okay. How much debt did they have? 40 bucks? Okay. Ledger. See what we can upgrade. Nice night, ain't it? Uh, the time is Cogger's Levy, but uh, other than that, uh, you're not really surprised still. Cool shit, indeed. Are you work? You killed half the population of the city. Rob the bank. I say pog you. You go collect the debt, which is uh, legally, and they have to pay it. I say we are champ. Makes sense. <laughs> yeah, it happens like that sometimes. Okay. Um, and I mean, we haven't really bought much from like these people, but we have money. May as well. Get rid of it. 
Don't want to die and lose a bunch of it. Um, and that is to resupply as well. Get that. Quality and quantity of food available at the pantry has increased. Okay, yeah, let's restock as well while we're at it. Actually, we can't. Um, ammunition arms. Yep, let's do that. Oh yeah, shit, I forgot I'm using the money to put money into the camp. By the way, never go into the ledger without having money in it. It doesn't let you leave if you don't buy anything. Seems weird. Ian. Hi, my friend. What are you wearing? Well, thinking of switching to yours, I guess. For now. Aww. Yeah, get away from Dutch. Oh, great. <laughs> hey, boy. oh, he's not there anymore. Aww. What should we call him? Well, he's a wanderer. He probably did something bad. Kane. His name is Kane. <laughs> Dog's not even there anymore. Jesus. Okay. Contribute. Uh, AC1 and uh, Crook demise at the same time. Indeed, very nice. You have money. What do you have? How much do we put in? Around 600 or something. We'll, uh, we'll give him like 1,400. Oh, no, that'll do. Don't too many, but if you want to. Yeah, we'll get some, we'll get some, uh, some stuff up. I mean, uh, what, 1,800, 1900's enough money. I don't really buy that many things anyway. So... Yeah, we'll just uh, we'll buy what we can. Obviously, leave some money in just in case. Um, lodging. Dutch wants something comfier. Okay, Dutch, you shall uh, get what you want. Camp members have been inspired to contribute more. How selfish are you? Are you even aware? Of the price on my head? The pressures I'm under? If you'd only talk to me, I could help. I want to help you, Dutch, but there's... Arthur wants you a map to help plan journeys. Me alone so I can actually think for once. Camp. Right, can you guys stop having an argument, please? That's pretty annoying. Thank you very much. Thank you. Multitasking doesn't sound right. I prefer polytask. <laughs> Too big brain for me. Um, I mean, do we need a boat thing, to be honest? I mean, we've got a thousand in it, so why not? Then we'll have, I think, everything in, there, in the camp unlocked. Uh, just wait ten minutes. Uh, we'll pass by in the whole camp. We'll see it. You didn't put a cent in the box for a while, Arthur. <laughs> And I will kill them all. Right. Arthur wants some uh, some nice things. Unlocks the fast travel map, allowing you to quickly travel to previously discovered locations. Also unlocks grooming supplies. Yes, please. Uh, now fast travel from your personal camp. Okay, so we have to be at the camp to do that. We can't just 
then for everyone improves the rest of the tents in camp improves overall mood yeah why not do that we'll have 200 left over 209 just about i think Easy clap. Uh, well, there we go. I think that is all of the upgrades done for a camp. At least I don't know if there's more coming. Probably, but yeah, there we go. Minus 1.4k apparently that. I mean, what? We've still got 1.9, so. I'm still good with that. We could go buy some outfits from the trapper or something. Uh, 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 hey, what, what is your story anyway, Micah? Hmm. I told you. I guess I missed it. Okay. Um, I mean, we could sleep until daytime. I don't see why not. Uh, there are times you've tried the big, uh, nicely request to teach people words uh, to small small birds while multitasking you call it polite asking polly asking polly tasking oh god that hurts <laughs> okay go sleep morning a four hour nap Ew. Okay. Wait, there's some cigarettes there. Oh, I think we're full. Uh, do we need a shave? Maybe. It's... Let's get rid of what is it we normally get rid of? The chin. And the chops. Go with the moosh. Let's get that growing. I want that really long. Taking that wake up three years later. I don't know. Okay. What are you doing? Morning. Hi there. Aaron is stew for us. Alright, what do we have to do then? We need to go back and see Bo. Tell him that we uh, gave the letter and the thing to, uh, what's her name? Whoever. Break into Jeremiah Compson's house and recover his possessions. Okay, we could go do that. That could be fun. There's this guy again. Albert Mason. Alright, I think we'll uh we'll head up here and do this one. Get that uh get that guy's money back. His personal belongings. They come back at one PM home, says he's gonna take a nap, wakes up at seven, and then goes back to sleep. You only wake up three years later, Levy. Teach me your ways. Thank you. Let us go. You set an inner alarm. Tell yourself three years is enough, and then you just do it. You just, just, just do it. You know. A symbol. Oh, another prisoner. Yeah, you don't want to know what I did please, to the last friend. one. You gotta help me out here. Yeah, do I? Come on, please. Uh huh. I'm about done here. 
If I don't get these shackles off soon, I'm a goner. And you will be a goner. Please. See ya. Do -do -do. Okie dokie. Just put that away. I want to know where this prison is. <laughs> They're doing a bad job at keeping them in. I'm helping them out. Uh, your dad, when he wakes up, uh, he goes back to bed, watches TV for five minutes, then falls asleep. Yet yeah, in the morning he says, I'm so tired. <laughs> You have to more convincingly lie to myself that three years is actually enough. Would help to replace those in alarm batteries too, though. Or, you know, upgrade them from a uh, lead nickel to 9 volt. Yeah. Right, actually, Blood Moon, you said you wanted a stunt, didn't you? Okay. On the lookout. And I'm seeing a cliff up there. Don't you worry. I got you. I'm, I'm gunning for it. Just you watch. Oh! I got him. Okay. This might be perfect. I might need to get a little bit of a run up. But, uh. Have a look. Can I use the varmint rifle to get to get a three star thing? That doesn't kill him. Okay, never mind. Try that for no reason. That looks like a nice cliff. Yeah, I think this might just kill us though. So I think what we might do is we'll save and then we'll uh, we'll load it back because I don't want to lose uh, lose some money. So let's uh let's go back here a little bit. You kill all F4, I'll kill you. Oh no. Please. <laughs> Please. Please no. Okay. Now where's it? Player. No. Story. Save game. Do it under a new slot. I can do a uh, chiropractic. Uh, you can hibernate and uh, absolutely free for the rest of your life. <laughs> just, just snap your neck. <laughs> I think I know what you're talking about, Vux. Okay, we're on that one. Want to be a bear, hibernate for 60 years, and then you uh, contract to the freezer method, cryogenic freezing, and then in 500, come back. Uh, be one of the only men who are 500 plus. Yeah, Fallout. Okay, well, this is the big moment. We've saved. I'm fully expecting both me and Alt F4 to die from this. So, um, yeah, let's uh, let's go ahead and do this. Oh fuck! Wait. Wait. Excuse me. Right. Um. How how did that happen? I swear we dropped from like two meters before, and we the horse nearly died. How was the horse not dead? <laughs> that, that's me question. How did that happen? Is he okay? He's full health. Uh. Hmm. Right, give me one second. Let's, uh, maybe let's try it again. Yeah, it might have been a glitch in the system there. Let's, uh... Oh, really? You're scared now, are you? Yep. Nope. Oh! Wait, how is he still full health? What is he made of? Okay, yeah, I don't, I don't know what's happening here. 
I guess that's not a big enough cliff. <laughs> Fuck. Okay, well, yeah, about saving. I guess we didn't need to. Um, now we just need to find a bigger cliff that will actually do some real damage. Like that one over there. That looks like a decent one. Okay. Yeah, I don't, I don't know how no damage was taken there. Yeah. Didn't believe hard enough. That's what it was. I'm gonna ramp off of this. Oh. Oh, but I'm gonna jump straight over it. That was pretty cool. I'm just trying to crash into stuff now. It's not working. Make contract after they die, the bodies get preserved. Uh, I don't know when in the future they can take their body out without destroying uh, it, or they could also re revive the person. Just imagine if that works. The people who are in there are lucky. Yeah, well, I feel like with the technology that we have at the moment, it actually isn't possible to free somebody. Um, just like freezing them and then like thawing them out would do so much damage, like internal parts, that it, you just wouldn't be able to survive. So, yeah, I feel like we're still quite far away from being able to like, cryogenically freeze ourselves somewhere. You know, cryogenics is a thing, but cryogenics uh, being a disease or something you contract, that to me means the xenomorph got you. <laughs> Don't revise your statements. Okay, search the house. Let's hope there's nobody in it. That will not be good. Uh, we've got our... Actually, put away the varmint rifle. Let us get out. Pump action. We have not many bullets for, actually. Double barrel. Just in case there's anybody inside. The note on the door. By order of Judge Meredith Holden in the courts of the state of Lemoyne, we do hereby grant repossession of this property and all items here into the Bank of Roads. M. Holden, Judge Holden, Henrietta Blackley Clerk, November 18th, 1895. Since when did we have people that spoke the letters to us? Okay. Oh, a cigarette card. And open gin. Uh, they're doing some special uh, ways of freezing, but they uh, aren't thought out without destroying everything. They replace the blood with some kind of solution that won't destroy the cells. Uh, now the body's just uh, got to wait and wait. Uh, they just wait for future technologies to remove bodies safely. Definitely still xenomorphs. Is that Robin Hood? Oh, it's Jim Cobb. I assume it's Robin Hood. Playing it. Okay, well if we can't get in the front door, can we bash it in? Let's have a look around. Oh, did I just break something? Oh, this is where we were. That was his house. We were in that barn there. Shoot the handle? Yeah, we could give that a go. That one's blocked off. Yeah, yeah, let's go shoot the handle. I was thinking that, but I would have thought it would like show up red or something if it was a if it was a thing that was breakable. Yeah, no, that doesn't work. The way, like, onto the roof or something? Huh. I 
back out back here. Where we had that big fight. Any poo? Pretty clean actually. Okay, well actually what is that that little um symbol next to the ammo there? This one. Like a club. Does that mean it's like upper level or something? Open up! Be high! Uh, guys, my PC is very special. No one has a PC like mine. It can literally do fireworks. <laughs> can we break through doors? Do we get in this house? They're just gonna do fireworks, sparklers, and smoke machine at the same time. Come on, you. <laughs> Hey Affen, how are you doing? Good to see you. Hope uh, everything is well. Trying to figure out how to get into this house. Oh wait, is this door open? Oh, it is. Oh, I'm I'm dumb. Okay, just wasted tons of ammo there. <laughs> Empty bottle. Uh, okay. Been having a little. Uh... Why well, don't you just enter the house? Yeah, that's a good idea. That actually, I think I'll give that a go. <laughs> Thanks indeed for your talk to our Sunday school class. <laughs> Thought you might like this drawing, young Josh did of you. He wants to grow up to be just like you, Sam. Um, how are things? Uh, you just chilling, feeling better? Not the ask, but you feel uh, you felt rotten earlier. Too much screen time? Yeah. It's like that sometimes. Uh, examine that. I hope you're feeling uh, feeling better now. At least a bit better. June 7th, 1855. Dear sir, please accept this likeness of your family as a small token of appreciation for your assistance in the recovery of my property. Like your old pa, you're a cunning old dog and a credit to this community. <laughs> Yours, Colonel Joshua Nixon, the Ascension Plantation. Okay. Thank you very much. Place that back. What else do you have for me? Search cabinet. Damn a man of fortune, and Jim must seek my fortune. Henry Avery. Yeah. And I, uh, I know that one. I mean, it was pretty hard to understand those, the writing, but, I mean, you know. Didn't think it would say jam. April 2nd, 1870. Dear Mr. Thompson, I'm afraid there's no more work for you down here at the plantation. I'm grateful for the help you've given us and the help your pappy and your pappy's pappy gave us before you. Pappy? These are trying times for all of us. You are in our thoughts and prayers. Yours truly, Colonel J. Nixon, the Ascension Plantation. I like how they're getting red to us. <laughs> Otherwise, I would have had to do it. Right, this is the watch he wanted. That's the old watch. Now the ledger and the 
Oh, premium cigarettes. Please. We've been jammed. Raspberry. Little ra raspberry jammer. Fish. Okay. Where's all this old crap? In there, a bit of apple. I can understand that writing, but only a little, and they say my writing is ugly. Look at those people. Raspberry Jam is one of the best things on this planet. Unless it's from Lone Star and Bath. Dear Jeremiah, there ain't nothing here any value. I wouldn't give you a nickel for it. Come by for a sup of whiskey anytime. Bill. Yes. I was sorry to hear of Betsy's passing. Things is easier up there for sure. Okay. Well, there's a medal there. Can we not pick that up? Seems important. I want to sell it. You love your handwriting? Well, technically that doesn't count as being something on this planet. Hmm. Hey, uh, Buckle Boy. How are you doing? Welcome. Konnichiwa. Fuckers. <laughs> love that little magnifying glass God emote. Told you to stay away from the boy. He don't want this. Heck. None of us want nothing to do with you. Heck. Rants. Rants. Ah, uh, a trap door, huh? Oh. Hell yeah. <laughs> what you oh god. Here? We found this place first. Yeah. Easy. I'm just looking around for some things. Hmm. That old revolver yours. <laughs> Finders keepers. Ah, son of a bitch! Oh, you idiot. Oh, God damn it. Come on, He's man. fucked it now. Oh, come on. Son. No, I want a shotgun. Of a bitch. Ah, you fuck. Wait, oh, my God. Jesus! Holy hell! <laughs> Fuck it! Fuck it, hell! That was brutal. Okay. Well, at least we got his gun. There we go. Wait, can we find the top of his head? <laughs> or does that just not exist anymore? Is that disintegrated? Oh, God. Okay, right, let's go loot the other guy as well. At least this guy didn't get his head blown off. Those, uh, these new robbers always lose their heads when they see all that. <laughs> Good one. Like that. Like, oh, he's enjoying it. <laughs> Listen, it's fine. Wait, his body moved and he's, has he lost a leg? Or has that just phased into the ground? Shit. Yeah, it's phased into the ground, okay. Oh god. Okay. Well, 
Well, that's that. I was somewhere near Rhodes when they caught me. Till the day I die, I ain't gonna forget the sound of that dog barking in my heels. But I don't suppose that day gonna be far off yet. It was 50 lashings yesterday and 50 more to come. I don't think I can take any more. Man said he was doing his job. But he kind of been wanting to do that. Hey, Definitiv. Welcome, guys. How's it going? Hey, uh, Mills. Hey, Jabbercon. Kez. How are we all doing today? How was, uh, how was the stream, guys? Was it a, uh, was it, what, race day? Or, uh, have you just, uh, chosen a new game? God. Look out, it's you, fat man! They're both birds. Yeah, how's it going, everyone? Thank you for uh, coming over with the raid. I really appreciate it. Oh, I don't want to read the diary again. I want that bottle of whiskey, actually. Can I get that? No? Okay. Yeah, how is everyone? Uh, race day. Finish the season. Ryan took it home. Ooh, very nice. So what uh, what game uh, did you play then to uh, finish off? Yoshi's Island DS. Very cool. I'll have to uh, try and watch the uh, VOD of that. January 18th, Louise. $12. May 18th, Wilfred, $18. He's not going to do all of these, is he? Mini and Child, $20. Oh, he just did like all of them. Okay. That was here. Um, it is me furious at your ISP for connection. Your stream crashed twice earlier and was, uh, that's the 1k bitrate, so it looked like shit in between. Yeah, Kaz, I've, uh, the stream has shut off for me. Is it three times today so far? I think after 10 minutes it was so bad we tried to reset. So reset my computer. And then after an hour it bugged out. And then after about 20 minutes the stream like disconnected. So I had to start it up again. So yeah. Is it a Twitch thing? I would assume so. Um, I mean it normally is. And Twitch is just having problems constantly. So I wouldn't put it past them. But uh, yeah, that's it's pretty trash to be honest. Um, Ryan's first win, he broke the streak. Go go gadget, Ryan. Um, Twitch is funky lately. Uh, all of your raids have uh, said raiding with zero viewers. Yeah, I had that. Uh, had that me last stream as well. Yeah, I, d I don't know what they're doing, but obviously it's it's annoying when uh, you know. Trying to have some fun and uh, I guess what, three times today it's all disconnected. Okay, so, you know, what can you do, eh? Can't do much. Yeah. Uh, glad you did not, uh, you decided not to stream today then, lol. Yeah. I mean, it's just annoying at this point, to be honest. I've had so, so many problems these past months that... You would think they would be like trying to do something about it, but I don't know. I'm trying hard enough. An AOC playing Among Us again, crashing the whole site. Damn. Which hasn't been working for like almost four months now. Yeah, definitely. Many years. <laughs> Which broke Twitch. We are putting it. But yeah, guys, thank you uh, very much for the raid. I really appreciate that. Shit on their boot. Times was perfect. I ain't saying that. It's just. Why do I need to confront them? Oh man! Oh man! You 
show some respect. I was respected once. I had a profession. You asked me to get you something. There's no bringing back what I want. I want my job, my pride, the respect accorded to a gentleman. What about this old crap? Huh? Friend, don't you understand? Those bastards have changed everything. I was a good worker. I took pride in my work. They, they, they took it away. Pissed on my legacy. Old man, some jobs ain't for saving. And some legacies, oh, they are for dude, pissing What off. are you doing? That's, that's my history. Damn you! It's not loaded, I'm sorry. Damn you! Wait, why did we do that? I still exist! Oh, <laughs> oh that was mean of us. I don't know why we did that. I'm sad now. I mind, I was going to do something there, but it won't let us. <laughs> Never mind. Doesn't matter. Uh, no problem, the raid. Uh, glad we could do it with some uh, time left in your stream. Yeah, to be honest, I don't know how long I've been going for. Since the uh, like timer has reset and everything. So, um, I'm thinking I've been going for maybe three hours combined. There's another hour left. Again, I have no clue. Uh, you're going to cook some uh, lunch so you'll be lurking. No problem, definitive. Again, thank you very much. And uh, yeah, enjoy. Indeed. Did you read the book? Yeah, I think uh, the person read it to us. Um, Like, we just sat with it open. And he read it. Okay. Do we go back and see Bo then? That's what we do. Won't do that. Okay. Trying to think now. We're kind of low down. There's not really any... Any big uh, cliff that we can try and stunt off of. Uh... Oh shit, is there a train coming? Yeah, I probably shouldn't have gone on this thing. Try and get off it quick. There's a crocodile. Um. Well then you don't understand why you feel you're you being mean at this miserable... Yeah, um, I probably didn't pay attention to most of it. Since I think the raid was coming in around that time. And I was kind of focused on that uh, thingy. But, um, yeah, if, if I miss something big, yeah, I, if, if he was, like, a bad guy or anything like that, kind of, uh, I forgot. So I'll have to go back and, uh, and uh, rewatch the stream. You okay, mister? What's he done? Please. I've been bitten by a snake. Okay. Uh, do you want some, medicine. want some medicine? Oh, oh, you need to suck the out. I'm not Drink sucking it out, it you help. weirdo. Is that medicine? Oh, 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 thank you, thank you. Oh, oh, oh. I owe you one, Mister. Not that right. Hopefully, I can repay you someday. Hope so too, those things are expensive. I gotta get out of here. Um, holy shit, Demise, you would not believe what happened. A couple of hours ago, police found a suspicious item under a car, taped off, and the bomb squad called. They were using disposable, uh, dis uh, disposal robot. Nothing serious. Damn. Indeed. Uh, I mean, it's all relative, you know, but, uh, yeah, he's a miserable bastard. Yeah, I'll have to definitely, yeah, go back and, uh, listen to the into that stuff again then there was just a lot uh, a lot of stuff going on at <laughs> at that moment wasn't really paying attention to the uh, 
for the dialogue on that. See, I'm still unsure whether we're, like, safe in this area or not. Pretty sure we are. Um, you go to bed now, still not feeling uh, super great. Take care and uh, stay safe. Talk to you tomorrow. No problem, Levy. Um, I really appreciate you being here today and uh, for everything. Thank you for the resub also. Very kind of you. Um, but yes, definitely... Uh, go rest up, get some sleep. Hope you're feeling uh, better tomorrow. Um, Friday, so. Got to look forward to the weekend. Yeah, thank you uh, very much for being here. And uh, I'll, uh, I'll speak to you soon. Oh, we're on this way. Now the guys seem, those guys had guns and they weren't doing anything, so. Seem okay. You got my money? Sure. Did she give anything? For me? Yes. Couple of coins. Sure. They look after you. Ah. I can't be bothered. Here, take it. Oh, thank you, Arthur. You're thank you. My God, what a woman. She's, this'll get her killed for sure. What? Women's suffrage. Around here, they don't- <laughs> Yeah, you missed the reference. <laughs> Wanna play a little game? Progress is a dirty word in these parts. Unlike incest. Excuse me? I don't want to marry my cousin Matilda. I want to marry Penelope. But they're gonna, they'll kill her at one of those rallies they're holding. They've done it before. Mister, you gotta help. No, I'm afraid I don't want no part of it. I'll pay. My family, we've still got some money. Fine. Just no more running around with letters. Thank you. Come on. We better get going. Okay. So you said that some got a rally? We need to stop. Come on, come on. Yeah. We'll go around the property and take the road to town. Easy boy, calm down. I can't be calm. If we don't get there in time, my true love may be shot. If she wants to rally, you gotta let her rally. Well, good as the cause is, I can't let her become a martyr to it. I, I want to marry a flesh and blood woman, not a statue in her honor. I'm sure oh, they God. know what they're doing. There, there they are. I see them. Bo, what are you doing here? I cannot let you go through with this. You'll be killed. I'm prepared to die for the cause, Bo. You know that. Do something, please. Do what? Fight this mob? We must begin. They leave me alive. This is no laughing matter, sir. They need protecting from certain elements. Mostly my family. Penelope, I beg you. I'll tell you what, your friend here can drive the wagon for us. It'll allow us to shout all the louder. Hip, hip, hooray! Sure. Miss Calhoun, Miss Calhoun, my friend here says he can drive the wagon. Well, Olive Calhoun, normally I like to drive myself, but today I feel like a man joining us sends the right message. Well, I ain't never been in a... Protest march before, madam. Well, just treat us like the sheep and the folks attacking us like the wolves, and I'm sure you'll feel right at home. Shall we go? <clears throat> All right, ladies. We know our song is a good one, mm -hmm. and we know our cause is a pure one. Yes, ma'am. Let liberty reign. We've been having so much fun uh, with the online the last few days. 
Yeah, I'll, def I'll have to check out uh, online, offline. Um, I've heard some good things. So yeah, definitely have to give that a go. What was your name? Arthur Morgan. Very good, Mr. Morgan. Not too quick and not too slow. We need them to hear our voice. Well, they'll hear it all right. Very good, very good. Mr. Morgan, are you an old friend of the movement? I'm just a driver, Mrs. Calhoun. Maybe a shotgun messenger if it comes to it. I'll be either playing with friends with uh, what makes it fun. Yeah, I'll have to see which uh, which of my friends have it. I know a few do. Look at these people. It's about to get exciting. I can feel it. I believe you might be right. Good day, Sheriff. I trust you'll make sure it's a peaceful assembly. Gentlemen, yeah. this is a great day for all of us. Yeah. For today is the day we begin to live as equals. Equals? Ah. Yes, equal, sir. Fair and equal. This is unnatural. This is nonsense. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, fair, equal, and free, just as the founding fathers intended. Yeah. Mm. Founding fathers, oh. not founding mothers, you hey, silly old goat. His philosophy hey. dependent on biology. What the hell are you doing here, boy? Keep your voice down. I'm trying to listen to the speech. Hello, darling cousin. Don't you ever speak to me like that. Shh. What are you doing here? Listening, I suppose. Go help Bo. His cousin is a moron. Stop them from ruining the speech. You need to learn yourself some manners, cousin. Haven't you got anything better to do? Oh, you always was Bo. a cocky little... Bo, weren't we just leaving? Well, who the hell is this? Follow me, Ron. Oh, uh, what? You'll hit me? Oh, come on. Good. Can you not see how idiotic you are? Come on, Bo. Let's go. Quick now. Actually, I want to figure out. I forgot the button for uh, the parry or counter or whatever. I want to know what that is in case we get into a fist fight. E mapping. Right, where is it? On foot. Health jump. On horse. Wagon boats. Combat lock on. F. Melee block is R. Okay, that's a bit weird. It should do though. I remember. We just, we just run away. They think twice. Oh Lord! Follow me. I know a place. It's an old battlefield. No one goes to. I think we've been to that one. Battlefield. Lead the way. You don't want to go back. Hear the speeches. I ain't voted before, but kind of getting hot for voting rights. I don't know whether to take you seriously, Mr. Morgan. My cousins are my primary concern right now. If everyone knows about Penelope and me... Everyone knows about Penelope and you. I know about Penelope and you, and I've been here all of ten minutes. The sooner it's out, the sooner it's resolved. The sooner it's dealt with, you mean. We're dealt with. Our families, the Greys and the Braithwaites, we bury our secrets, and we bury them deep. Your secrets and your treasure. You know, Catherine Braithwaite's got a daughter. No one's seen her in years. She weren't right, you know, and Penelope said... Uh, I, I ain't heard about daughters. 
I heard about gold. But Yankee gold? I fear that's just a story, Mr. Morgan. But I don't know. This okay. is awful. Nobody Big blood died. There. It ain't that awful. My cousins are vindictive bastards. My brothers are vindictive bastards. My cousins are worse. They started it. I know. But you should leave. I will. As soon as I have enough money. When my family, we have money, but I don't. Is your family very rich? Yes. Well, I believe so. But uh, they keep me out of the discussions. I have more of a artistic temperament, so. Oh, is that what they call it? Yes. Oh, you made a joke. <laughs> I really love her. I do. Well, stick oh. around. The big sack of cash. As well. I thought you were trying to make me feel better. Look, I gotta go. Me too. Oh, damn. I'm gonna be late. My uncle is quite as bad as you would imagine. Uh, here, your payment. Thank you. I excuse me. Here. Yeah. How much? 30 bucks. Come on, I thought you were rich. Hey, who's that ear mission? Oh, it's back at camp. Abigail. Advertising the new American art. Right, yep. you. We'll do that. Oh, we can drift in this horse. It's a good brushing as well, actually. Oh, press that button. There we go. Guys, just getting, uh, you know. Oh shit! Horsey. Down here, strangers got a cough up payment. I'm done being kind. Last warning. I can't. Uh, I don't want to surrender. Oh shit! Why the? Where are they coming from? Okay. Sell the wagon at the wagon fence in Emerald Ranch. Where is that? It's pretty far up, isn't it? Yeah. I don't think we can go there. We'll just take it back to camp. Silly people, eh? What do they think they're doing? I think it's pretty close to us. Oh, good, sir. I couldn't have <laughs> the point in Robin if he does that. Jesus. Just now he died there. Fucking hell. <laughs> oh my god. He shot fast as well. Stupid fool. Should have just handed it over. Wait, how much did he even have? Probably didn't have a lot, did he? Yeah, I think we can uh we'll just run back to camp. It's not that far.
Who's on watch tonight? Lenny. It's me. You're alive. Yeah. Alright, we'll call back the horse as well, so it's not a problem. Okay, uh, retrieve all F4. There we go. You want to sit down, Arthur? Uh, yeah, sure. Sit down for a bit. Real low. tried to rob it. I mean, I, I was I was just out of the army, and I, I was drinking like a fish, and uh, I, I, I was still sticking up folk on the highway, just uh, out west of the mountains. And, and, and Dutch got one look at me. I was just, I was just drunk, and I was angry. <laughs> and and he, he just burst out laughing. <laughs> and I was so mad. I swear I could have put a slug in him. But he uh he sheared me up and uh, he, he gave me purpose. And now I sense some of you fools are doubting him. And that makes me so angry, because he saved me. He saved Bill Williamson. And he can do it again. So for all you sons of bitches, you fools that are doubting him to go, please just run away, just get the hell out of here. But you know what? I know you won't. None of you will. Because you're all the same. You're just like me. So you just, you have faith. We, we've all got to have faith. Because this, this is Dutch Vanderland that we're talking about here. This is, this is Dutch Vanderland. Thank you for sharing that story, Bill. Very nice of you. You tell them, Bill. Somebody's about him. For sure. Okay, nice talk. Um, these demise only you have the power. Yeah, I think I did. Uh, I did get rid of him, didn't I? I don't think it's there anymore. Okay. Let's go speak to uh, oh, Abigail, was it? Hey, Arthur. What's going on? Jose and John are looking for you. They went out to the moonshine stash, said you knew where that was. They was planning a visit to the Braithwaite place, but John needs to do something for Dutch now, so Hosea wants you to join him instead. <sighs> Seems to be a lot going on. You're telling me. Okay, thank you. So, what do you think of this place? Better than your little hermit camp, right? Oh, it's wonderful, Arthur. Thank you for asking. Okay, so where's Jose? Oh, he's just up there. Las copas llenas. ¿Dónde están? Alrighty, let's go see what he wants to do with this moonshine. Hey Arthur, what are you doing? 
selling it back to where it came from. Why? Well, I ain't got a market for it. They made it, they must have someone to sell it to. <coughs> Stuff look kind of lonely out here. I think we'll cut ourselves a deal. Uh, I get you. You and Dutch was just doing your duty when you requisitioned it. Now I'm doing mine. All right. I should get going now. I'll leave you fellas to it. Good luck. Thank you, John. We'll see you later. Dutch asked him to look into something. Bye bye, John. Horses, I think. Oh, okay. Okay, let's head out to the Braithwaite's place. You know the way? Yeah, I've been there. So, what exactly are we doing? This is the moonshine we took after blowing up the Braithwaite still, right? I think the good citizens taking the trouble to return their stolen goods deserve some reward, don't you? Then it's time we made a formal introduction, like Dutch told us. Look, these are two big old plantation houses. All I keep hearing is they hate each other so much they can't see past it. I know. I've seen it. There's a great boy. Pretty a grand. Girl carrying on a secret affair. I've been, well, helping them. The mind boggles. You think they're of use? Not sure. They don't seem too involved in the rest of it, but maybe. Well, I'm sure there's money in this for us somewhere if we can get in the middle of it. Hello, gentlemen. How are you? What's that in the back there? Moonshine, my fine fellow. May I have a word with the man of the house? The man of the house is a lady. Mrs. Catherine Braithwaite. May I speak with her? I want to discuss a business opportunity. I mean no harm. No harm at all. You may happily shoot me if I do. <laughs> okay. Okay. She's at the house. Oh, he's jumped on the back of it. We'll be watching you. You heard the man. Driver, proceed, please. This is very nice. Yeah, we couldn't actually see this, but yeah, we passed this in uh, in like pitch black. What you want? Found something out in the hills. Thought. Thought maybe you was in the market for it. For what? Some liquor. I ain't in the market for what's already mine. The way we see it, it's ours. Well, with us possessing it, and I, I checked all over. For the life of me, I couldn't see your name on it. Oh. Relax, I ain't here to rob you. Oh, it seems that's easy enough. Why don't I do a deal? What do you sell that stuff for? dollar a bottle. You give us 50 cents. It's already ours. Well, look on it as a reward for finding the property. Alternative is we go sell it someplace else. The alternative <laughs> is you get shot. Now, who wants to get shot over a bottle or two of liquor? <laughs> Pay the man. Pleasure doing business with you. And listen, uh, we didn't take it, at least not without orders. From... Oh, I know exactly who gave you your orders. Old Sheriff Gray. You know what? I don't want it. In fact, sir, now you can do me a favor. There's an extra ten bucks if you do. Drive the stuff into Rhodes, head over to the tavern run by Mr. Gray, and give the stuff out for free. Mama! Hush now. I believe they call that a promotional expense. <laughs> As you wish, madam. You boys come back sometime and tell me how you made out. Maybe we'll play a little cribbage. All right. Next stop, the road saloon. Sounds good to me. Here we go. Free liquor. I'll take a few bottles. So I finally sold those Cornwall bonds. Got close to a thousand for them. I wanted more, but not bad considering how hot they were. Especially after that bloodbath in Valentine. No, not bad at all. Apparently, Cornwall's been pumping a lot of cash into the Pinkertons. Wants to keep their full effort on going after gangs. Gangs like us. Yeah. That don't surprise me. Yeah. All right. This could get ugly. You and Dutch already have that thing going on in town. The sheriff. <laughs> 
Yeah, Mr. Gray. That's it. Now we're inserting ourselves in his blood view. We'll we could just take this out into a field and blow it up. You know my feelings about that. Of course you're not. You're you're a clown's idiot brother. I'm the clown. You're the brother turned idiot. Just Switching mobile, no problem, Mux. Keep quiet. Even you can do that, Arthur. Oh, I have to. Put this hat on. Smoke this pipe. Yes, sir. Nearly for just a bit. Squint. Oh, perfect. Hey, what about you? You can't speak. You're turned idiot. Right. Broke poor mammy's heart. Well, they've got guns. Okay. Can we give this all out? Stay calm now. For Mama, she loved you so. <laughs> Just a shame you had to strangle her in a rage, right? Grab two cases of that stuff and follow me. <laughs> Gentlemen! Gentlemen! Right the town you have here. We just rode in from up north. Hey. Hello. Hello, I'm Melvin. This is my brother Fenton. Don't mind him. Don't madden him. He's turned idiot. <laughs> Killed our mother, but it weren't his fault. How'd you boys, how'd you boys like a couple of bucks? I bet you would. One for each of you. We're in the new trade of advertising, which is an American art form about ensuring people buy the correct things. I don't know. One more dollar. Says give us half an hour. What harm can we do in half an hour? <laughs> Go along now. Enjoy the money. Ow. Come along, Fenton. Just hand out the liquor. Okay. And we've left a wagon load. in this year bar in this year town are entirely free yeah. the only rule is that you gotta drink them so hurry up put old Penton to work yeah. don't get him mad though his mama made him mad and we buried her the whole thing. Ah. now come up to the bar everybody come on fellas. how's this gonna be a mini game What is happening? <laughs> like the uh, the music. Oh God. Uh, what game on Sunday? Um, I think we'll be continuing with Trials. Drink 
Good evening, gentlemen. Quiet libation. You, me. You're the bastards who stole the liquor we was gonna buy. Joe, we're in advertising. Uh, come on in and have a drink. That's our goddamn liquor. An honest mistake. Boys, get him. You ain't gonna do shit, mister. Hit him. Oh, don't know how that exactly hit him. Oh shit. And time. Oh, he's he's uh, driving, okay. I don't have any weapons. Are you finished, Blood Moon? Welcome back. Oh god. That was a horse stunt. How are we doing, Blood Moon? Hope you can uh, chill out and uh, relax a bit now. What do we have? Infinite ammo? Oh god. Oh my oh that horse is lucky. There we go. Works over you getting out while the uh, phone's not ringing. Uh, but so you sleep better now, thanks. Very good to hear. I'm glad. Well, we've just been uh, having a nice little a little sing song in a bar with some moonshine. Lots of moonshine, actually. Um, and uh, we've nearly just been killed, but you know, fun times. As usual. Alright, we're going to destroy this stuff, the rest of it. Set us up. No, I don't think so. Maybe. This place is odd. Yeah, I keep seeing those fellas. Some local militia. Clearly not too happy to have some new competition. I'll go visit old Mob Braithwaite, see what's what. Why? We've been making money. The chest is filling up again, slowly but surely. Part of me thinks we just get ourselves good and lost. But we still need a lot more money before that can happen. So, for now, let me go give old Mrs. Braithwaite some of this moonshine as, well, let's call it a peace offering. Sure. That was fun, Fenton. We'll make an actor of you yet. Yeah. <laughs> I'll go speak to Dutch. Um, it sounds great. You actually do have uh, some shine at home. Oh, very nice. Well, what do you think? About what? Fine folks around these parts. Oh, real nice. Exactly. 
On the one side, we have got the Gray family. Scots, degenerates, drunkards, the local law. You couldn't make this stuff up. Rich as Croesus. And on the other, their mortal enemies, the Braithwaites. Moonshiners, hypocritical, both rolling, we believe. In gold. And in the middle of it all, you got some inbred retailing of Romeo and Juliet. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so what you boys thinking? We try to rob them both. You sure? Why not? Because we got lawmen in three different states after us. Last thing I want is to get us into trouble, but we need money. Now, we have the opportunity here to put ourselves in the middle of something ain't nobody gonna know we was here. Because even without us, these fools are gonna kill each other okay, anyway. Okay, well, Jose's gone back to see that Braithwaite woman. Good. Hosea should definitely take the lead on this. I sent Sean over to Braithwaite Manor, too. Now, you can meet up with them, or join John and Javier at the Gray's place. Something to do with the Braithwaite's prize horses. Well, how the hell did we get in at the Gray's place? Sheriff Gray kindly put in a word with his father. It ain't that complicated. <laughs> we gotta convince each family that we're on their side, and then we rob them both. Before they figure out it was us that done it, and not the other lot will be long gone. Think of it as payback for my daddy. Payback? Mm. I ain't in the revenge business, Dutch. Least of all for something happened a long time ago. Well, I guess we all gotta pay for something. Now, if you will excuse me, Arthur, I got to write a letter. Well, shit. I would have thought that maybe he's going after the Braithwaite's and leaving the Greys would be a better idea. Because if we have them as friends and they're on the side of the law, that would help, would it not? Yeah, I don't really go with this plan, but... Sure. And yeah, you've been uh, keeping you on uh, to help listen to uh, in between player calls. Such as whack. I mean, yeah, I don't want to. Yeah, I would have chosen to leave the Greys alone. Mr. Morgan. Yeah, well, Susan. You've stopped paying into the box. Fuck off. I've been sort of busy, Miss Grimshaw. Hmm. Well, we all need to eat, Mr. Morgan. <sighs> I'll see what I can do. Thank you. Yeah, I don't know what she's talking about. I literally put in like 1.2 grand earlier. I was just chatting crap. Uh, why? Okay. Um, he going to sleep? Can we still buy stuff from here? You're gonna catch your death if you don't get warmer clothes. I can just take stuff. Stock up on stuff that I don't have. Health cure, rum, gin, seem pretty good. We are low on most things. Let's uh, have a bite to eat. Have some of that. Right, happening around the fire. on that bank job loved every minute there'll be plenty more where that came from hey hello mr morgan uh but you're gonna head out uh, to get started on your way home he'll keep you on lurk for as uh as long as it works to listen to on, on the drive back uh you'll be safe enough <laughs> well i hope so blood moon and uh yeah i appreciate you uh being here today uh means a lot and i hope uh yeah, get home safe, and uh, Friday tomorrow, look forward to the weekend, and uh, yeah, I hope you can uh, rest up a little after, uh, you know, the idiots. <laughs>
But yeah, I appreciate you uh, you being here. I think we might actually end it up here also today. I'm thinking we've gone for around four hours. So, uh, yeah. I think uh, it's about time we call it as well. Um, thanks to the stream and the stunts. <laughs> They've helped you a lot. No problem, Blood Moon. Thank you so much for uh, for being here. There, uh, yeah. Speak to you. Uh, speak to you soon. Thank you so much. But um, yeah, I'm gonna call it here for a stream. Uh, I believe we've been going for four hours again. Like I said, kind of hard to tell now since I've had to restart the stream like three or four times now, which is a pain. But you know, it happens. Okay, let us see who is online and see who we can uh, go and spread the love to. And uh, in Crooks playing uh, AC1, is he? I think we'll go say hello to him. Get the stream up. Yeah, I think the internet's just being slow at the moment anyway. Um, see you Saturday. Indeed, Mux. Uh, chill stream on Saturday, so that'll be lots of fun. Yeah, chill out with you guys and uh, and play some fun games. Um, thanks, buddy. Have a fantastic uh, night, my dude. Uh, always a good time. Thank you so much, Kez. Um, I really appreciate you uh, being here today. Also, um, means a lot. And uh, yeah, indeed, definitely. Uh, I have been stopping by and watching some uh, some of your Red Dead uh, online stuff, and uh, it looks like a lot of fun. So I'm definitely going to try that out myself at uh, at some point. But uh, I appreciate you uh, you being here. Okay. Let us uh, set up uh, the raid here for the, uh, is it Animus or is it Crook? I think it's Crook, yeah it's Crook. Uh, hope the stream works better next time, yeah, I uh, definitely hope so. But um, yeah guys, so Saturday and Sunday will be our next streams. Um, on Sunday it'll be more Red Dead and on Saturday it'll be like a chill stream. Play some City Skylines. Stuff like that. Yeah, zero viewers. Yeah, that's just Twitch being silly. <laughs> um, but yeah, I appreciate everybody being here today. Uh, we had uh, quite a few resubs. We had uh, Levy, Hero, and Crook with the resub. Uh, Levy for four months, Hero for two months, and Crook for four months. And uh, thank you also, Definitive, for uh, the raid of nine. That was uh, very kind of you guys. Really appreciate that. But, um, yeah, we're all ghosts, apparently, to Twitch. <laughs> they don't care at all. Yeah, guys, um, Mux Kez, thank you all for being here today, Blood Moon. Um, just everybody. Thank you, uh, thank you all for being here. Really appreciate you. And, uh, yeah, see you, uh, see you on the weekend. Have a, have a good, uh, Friday. I'll, I'll probably speak to you guys in, in somebody else's stream. But yeah, good night, guys. <laughs>